Hi, Dr. Jeff Bannis, and I'm going to talk a little bit about why you slow down in long distance running races like marathons, and more importantly, how you could actually get faster. Now, if you've done marathons before, or if you've done some type of long distance, when you kind of hit that wall and start really slowing down, let me ask you, are you slowing down because of cardio? Are you slowing down because you need to catch a breath? Or are you slowing down because your legs are tired, your feet are tired, or your back are tired? Now, I would guess that the majority of you are slowing down because you got pain in your legs or fatigue in your legs and you're, and, and you're sore um, and your muscles are breaking down and not because you need to stop and take a breath. And the reason why you're slowing down more than likely is you did not add your strength training into your running program. Okay? What you need to do is you need to build up some muscular fatigue resistance. You've got to build those muscles and allow them to take that pounding over that distance you know, of running. Now what I have found, the best way to do that is like a CrossFit style type of workout. Okay, um, Short, high intensity, um, full range of motion, uh, tire flips because you're going into the deep squat, uh, you're using the multi-dimensional movements, you're not stuck at the gym in some machine. Um, it doesn't have to be that long. I know you're a runner and I know you like running and I know uh, that's what you want to do but the problem is you got to do more than just run especially if you want to be a little bit faster and if you want to avoid injury and if you want to avoid breaking down the long distance. Now honestly you probably only have to do maybe about an hour a week maybe two 30 minute high intensity um, exercise sessions might be enough for you to get you by. Now there are specific reps and sets and lift loads that will help you at specific times of the year where, where you're at in your, your season, but don't neglect the strength training. The best thing that you can, and, and strength training also includes like hill repeats, running up at race pace or even above race pace, like running up hills and stuff. But you gotta do a little bit more than just running. You do, like I said, I really like a CrossFit style. So look up some CrossFits. I got some programs or some videos on some workouts. But make sure if you want to prevent the, the muscle fatigue resistance, if you, if you are running and you're slowing down because your legs are si tired, um, it's more likely because you haven't added strength training. So rule here, just add two 30 minutes of strength training into your running program. I think you'll be really help me, help, I think you will be really happy with the results. Got it out. Thanks.